As they work into three and four, they will make their way to the VP Racing Fuels, making PowerPoint. They're there, we're green, and we are officially underway with the Mr. Dirt Track USA here at Lebanon Valley Speedway. Peter Britton goes to work from his pole starting spot, leading the field through, turns one and two off the east end, down the back straight away, a quick getaway for Peter Britton out in front. Fills up a nice lead up at a turn number three over Adam Pearson in second. Mark Johnson has grabbed third, and he's quickly going after Adam Pearson here off a of turn number four, completing lap number one, Peter Britton in command. Into the corner, battle for the number two spot as the nine of Mark Johnson works over Adam Pearson. Pearson too strong down the backstretch. Behind them, side-by-side side race for position number four. Billy Decker on the outside. He has got flag to the inside. Decker bobbles through the corner. He's going to lose one, make it two spots now as the four Bichetti shoots on by down low. So Bichetti charging here early on. He is now into the top five. It's Keith Flack down low. Andy Bichetti up high. They wheel and deal off a of turn number four. Here in the front straight away, you can see how close they are together. Side to side, both now trying to gain ground on third place man Mark Johnson as Bichetti gets by Keith Flack. He'll grab the number four spot away. Now again, here comes Bichetti diving low on Mark Johnson. He'll look to pull the slide job off at turn number two. We've got a new card in spot number three. Give it to the wild child, Andy Bichetti. Adam Pearson right there all over Peter Britton now. Peter Britton trying to keep Adam Pearson behind him. Into turn number one, Pearson continues to follow suit. No point to press the issue here. Oh, problems here on the front straightaway. Car slow heading into the infield. That is Mark Johnson. So Mark Johnson coming into the home track looking for a solid effort here tonight. Johnson off the pace and your top three knows the tail. Now they have traffic in front of them and this traffic is racing side by side. So off at turn number four, 40 laps complete this time by. Speaking of side by side, oh, trouble on Adam Pearson's car. Pearson off the pace down here in the turn number one. The end of what was a great run going by the driver out of the Green Mountain State. Adam Pearson in the Gage Landscaping 215 car drops by the wayside here on lap 39 as Pearson back behind the wall just past the one-third mark. Out front, Andy Bichetti pulled alongside Peter Britton on the front straightaway. So now he regroups off of turn number two. He is chasing the 21A of Peter Britton through turn three and four. Here comes Andy Bichetti. Bichetti looking for the lead off of turn number four at the line. New race leader, it's Andy Bichetti here on lap number 42. Into the corner we go. Keith Flack trying to find his way around the 21A of Peter Britton. Andy Bichetti since taking the lead. He has not run away and, and hit from these two like we thought he would. He's only about five car lengths in front. Now Flack trying to pull the slider through three and four. Not going to be able to clear it off at the turn. They come to the stripe. Give the spot to Britton by a bumper. Peter Britton hanging on to the runner-up spot there. Keith Flack doing everything he can down on the flat of the speedway down through turn one and two. He got a great launch off of turn number two that time, and he'll nose ahead down to the west end, move Keith Flack up into the runner-up position as they come to halfway this time by. But Decker continues to challenge Peter Britton here to turn one. Britton pushing up the hill just a little bit there on entry into turn one. Opens up the opportunity off of two for Billy Decker to try to take advantage of the back straightaway. They're side to side, wheel to wheel, all the way down along Lebanon back straightaway. And now with the advantage off of turn number four is Billy Decker to the inside. He'll make that pass complete, and Billy Decker will grab the number three spot away from Peter Britton. He'll work the cushion through the corner. Oh, we've got trouble on the back stretch. Peter Britton off the pace, Brian Berger. Watching the video replay here now over in turn number two. They come down here off the corner. Britton, something had happened. He had slowed, and he was trying to get down to the bottom side of the raceway. Brian Berger tried to sneak by on the inside. He had already committed to the inside lane. We can see the damage. In turn four, we're back on it. Back on the gas here at Lebanon Valley. And Andy Bichetti goes back to work up in front, leading the field up through turns in one and two, and a quick getaway trying to gap the 43 of Keith Flack quickly here. Look at the race for third is on. Brett Haas, Kyle Armstrong side to side as they battle hard through the west end. Haas up on the high side. Armstrong to the inside, a little bit of contact there. And trouble on the 11 a.m. Armstrong as he slows here in the front straightaway. So Shepard had some problems and now caution is gonna resume 
uh, once again here as it's for the 11 of Armstrong. Again, I saw it come by right front flat. Not sure if there's any other damage uh, to that ride. And Stuart Friesen has stopped on the backstretch. Field comes the green here on the home stretch. Then immediately the yellow flag comes right back out. Yellow lights right back on. So we are caution again. Stuart Friesen stopping over there on the back straightaway. As we get set to go back to racing green here. So green flag is displayed here on the home stretch. We're back to it. Andy Bichetti, your race leader into turn number one. Flack there for the number two spot. Now, Brett Haas taking advantage of the restart. He's moving up to the podium as he goes by Billy Decker. Decker going to try to rally and regroup on the outside as they go to turn number three. Decker keeps it up on the top side. Shepard right there as well. Off of turn number four, though, it's going to be Haas into third. Now Shepard working on Decker. Moments ago, we were talking about Shepard falling back through the field. Now Shepard is into the top five and looking for more off of corner number two. Into three and four. Shepard will go low. Here comes Schroeder around the outside. Can Colby Schroeder put the number 99 into the top five off of turn number four? No, so close, so close for Colby Schroeder, but I think he's gonna get it done this time off of two, and indeed he does. New fifth place man, Colby Schroeder. But all eyes now on the four of Bichetti as he works through three and four to the white flag. White flag in the air. Final lap around the high banks of the Valley of Speed in the 2022 edition of Mr. Dirt Track USA. Here's Key Flag trying to pull it all out now. Got a little bit closer there in turn two, but McKinney is away, down the back straightaway. The Wild Child with a Garrity Asphalt reclaiming number four car coming out around. He'll see the double checkered flags in the air as Andy McKinney wins at the Valley of Speed, Mr. Dirt for 2022. Well, let's hear it for him. Andy McKinney, your winner here. And Mr. Dirt Track USA for your two in a row. Well, I was just hoping that tire was going to make it. Uh, we made uh, made the right tire call. My guys, uh, you know, we were going back and forth, but uh, I think we made the right one. And, uh, you know, uh car wasn't perfect, but we got there and uh, rode it out. And, uh, man, this is awesome. This is awesome. Uh, just uh, can't say can't say enough about Mike Garrity. He's, uh, he's an awesome guy, and um, he makes all this possible for us. My dad, he's home watching right now, and uh, you know he's probably jumping up and down too. My mom, everybody, my wife, my kids, uh, just, just, it's a real good night for them. Now that's that's uh, that's a feat in itself to uh, be qualified for that race. So we'll uh, we'll move forward. All right. Well, congratulations, and go enjoy this win with uh, everybody that's cheering behind me over here. Yeah, it's a happy happy bunch of people, and it's a way to leave Lebanon Valley with a track championship and uh, Mr. Dirt. All right, well, congratulations again to Andy Bacchetti, your winner here tonight, track champion, taking home the big money prize.